Hi, in this video we're going to find some function compositions. So we have two functions here, f and g. f is a function from this set here. This is the set of all two by two matrices into the set of real numbers. And it's defined as follows. It basically takes the sum of the diagonal elements. And g is a function from the real numbers into the set of all ordered pairs. And it takes x and it sends it to the ordered pair 2x comma x squared. And we have two questions. We have to find GOF of this matrix here and then likewise here. Let's go ahead and work through it carefully. Solution. So when we're working this out, we want to work right to left. So this actually is equal to G of F of, and then our matrix here, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And we have a bracket, parentheses, and then another parentheses here for the G. And we want to work again right to left, so we're gonna first evaluate this piece here. This is equal to G of, so now we're gonna look at F. F is basically this function that's defined up here. And again, you just add up the diagonal elements, so A plus D. So in this particular case, it's just one plus four. So this is one plus four. This is equal to G of five. And now we can look at G. G takes x and sends it to this ordered pair here. This will be two times x, so two times five, comma, and then five squared. So this is equal to 10, comma, 25. And so that takes care of part A. So now we have to do part B, which is very similar, except in part B, we have uh, no numbers, we just have variables. Let's go ahead and do part B solution. So as before, um, we're gonna start by using the definition of composition. So this is the same thing as G of, F of, and then our matrix A, B, C, D. And parentheses and then parentheses here for the G. And this is equal to G of, and again, F just basically adds the diagonal elements. So this will be A plus D. And then now we just look at G. Here's g, it takes x to the ordered pair 2x comma x squared. So this is going to be parentheses two times x, except our x is this whole thing here. So it'll be a plus d, and then a plus d squared. So a plus d quantity squared. All right, good stuff. And now we can just basically multiply all this out. We can distribute the two, two times a is two a, two times d is two d. And then here we can multiply this out as well. There's a simple formula. Uh, you square the first term, so a squared. You multiply these and double them, so a times d and then times two, so two ad. And then you square the last term, so plus d squared. And that would be the answer to part b. So just a simple example of computing function compositions where one of your functions actually takes a matrix and send it to, sends it to a real number and the other one takes a real number and sends it to an ordered pair. So a little bit different from the typical examples that you might see in like a basic algebra class. I hope this video has been helpful to someone. Good luck.